Hey everybody, I'm Busy Boss Mom. Today we're going to make a Beetlejuice wreath. We need ribbon, a wreath ring, pipe cleaners, printout, mesh tubing, letters, and scissors. Okay, I printed out a picture of Beetlejuice from the internet. I laminated it. If you don't have a laminator, you can buy the laminating sheets and you can put a cloth on top of the sheet and iron it. It'll do the same effect as a laminator. I also hole punched all four corners of the sheet and I'm just going to trim off the excess a clear part of it, but now I'm going to tie it down onto my wreath ring with the pipe cleaners. Okay, we're going to start cutting the ribbon. You can use a rotary cutter or scissors, whichever you prefer. I'm cutting them all at 14 inches. After the green ribbon, I'm going to do the black and white striped and then the solid black ribbon as well. Okay, time to add our pipe cleaners to the wreath ring. I'm going to use black here at the bottom and then all the rest of it, we're going to use the green pipe cleaners. Okay, now that we're done with our pipe cleaners, time to attach our ribbon. We're going to fold it in half in the middle and just secure it down with a couple twists of our pipe cleaners. Remember, this is supposed to resemble the clothing of Beetlejuice, so we're just going to stay around the neck area. And the remainder of the wreath ring we're going to do with a green ribbon. Okay, just some finishing touches with my black ribbon. We're just going to add it in between the black and white striped ribbon just to make it nice and full. Again, using the pipe cleaners to twist it on. Okay, time to start with the green ribbon. I'm going to use the same method, folding it in half and securing it onto our wreath ring using our pipe cleaners and a couple of twists. I'm also going to use the mesh tubing on the green part. I'm going to place it diagonally on top of the ribbon and I am putting loops. However, at the end, I'm going to trim both ends of the loops to give it a more hair-like effect.
right, we're all done with the green ribbon and cutting all the loops. I got a piece of solid black ribbon that I'm going to put here right underneath the neck. I'm going to make it look like a necktie. Just cut it in the shape of that. And I just hot glued it here at the bottom. Check it out. I have a greeting card that I used for another project. I'm going to just peel this lettering off and hot glue it onto the wreath. I got our final product. I love the way everything came out. I also like the little touch of the necktie that we added to it. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Once again, I'm Busy Boss Mom. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and like every single one of my videos. I can't wait to see you guys soon for our next project.